Salutations viewers, my name is Game Dame and welcome back to another one of Game Dame Reacts with one of my most highly anticipated games, or if not the most highly anticipated game I have for this year is The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom and I cannot fucking wait as Zelda is my favorite franchise of all time. So let's go ahead and watch the gameplay trailer for it because I cannot wait for this shit to come out. Absolutely loved Breath of the Wild. I thought it was amazing. So well done. It's got kind of a spooky ambiance, doesn't it? Are we rise, delving rise, deeper? Oh, I do not like that. Hyrule. Eliminate this kingdom and her allies. I definitely prefer the Japanese Leave voices. No survivors. <laughs> Oh shit, everything's falling down. Dude, they got swords coming out of their head. The little goblin boys. I don't think they had that in the Breath of the Wild. Oh, a little more aerial stuff. I like. Oh, those are cool enemies. But Link, Ugh. I'm not sure you'll be able to stop him. I hate the American voices for Breath of for this. I just think the Japanese ones are just so much better. I'm not saying that all dubs are bad, but a good bit of them are. And I don't know why they gave Zelda kind of like a bridge voice. It suits her, but it's no thank you. Not for no for me, dog. But it looks, it looks exactly like Breath of the Wild, just heightened to what we're seeing so far. We don't really know anything of the story, at least not yet. Bum, 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 bum. Please, lend him your power. And I will be in freaking Japan when this shit comes out, I swear to God. But that's fine because I'll be in Japan, obviously. So uh, that's a once in a lifetime opportunity to go to travel to Japan. And this game will be waiting for me. And you guys will already have played it a couple weeks when I get back. So we have all of that to thank, which is very fun. I, again, I'm not one for the dub version. I am very much for the sub version. I just don't think the dub version gave it that extra oomph, that extra drama for me. And the sub version definitely gave it it was giving so much and I loved it. I do think it looks kind of exactly like Breath of the Wild, am I, uh, which as it should be, it's the spiritual successor of it. Uh, I just wanna see more of the fine details that kind of separates it from Breath of the Wild and what more they have done with it to heighten it because that's what I'm looking for within Tears of the Kingdom. And I'm curious as to what we're gonna be doing with his arm. So I'm very excited to hear about the story because that will be the main thing that will separate it from Breath of the Wild. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of Tears of the Kingdom so far, because I know we're going to be getting plenty of more trailers to delve deeper into the Zelda universe for Tears of the Kingdom. But that is all the time I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I highly appreciate your time as always. But please do not forget to subscribe and or follow not only to my YouTube, but to my Twitch. You guys know where my YouTube is at, but you can find my Twitch at twitch.tv slash thegamedame. Thanks, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Oh, I had a little burp there. Bye-bye. Thank you.